and welcome to a special video from me, Firefox. This video is basically going to be um, a video on Witchera. Um, I am currently uh, standing within the Embrace the Fire server. Uh, we are actually currently running the uh, Direwolf 20 pack. So there is a lot of people on the server and uh, some people are getting a bit confused some people don't know what they're doing and I really really absolutely love I absolutely love the mod Witcher I think it's an amazing mod uh, I have actually completed it in um, my actual base um, this is not my base this is just a setup uh, that I've done that I will be giving away after the after this tutorial stroke um, let's play is finished so you will end up with everything in this room everything in this room exception of this setup right here this will be going uh, I'll just flatten the wall off again but this is just to make this tutorial um, let's play a little bit easy on um, ourselves uh, this is actually my personal ME system I've just uh, put a quantum thing in over here and I'm also using my own power as well but yes, I will be giving it away. I will be giving this entire room away. So whatever we do in this room, you know, you guys can, uh, oh, we'll get it. Uh, I will do some kind of competition or something at the end of the uh, thing and we'll give a deadline. And then at the end of that, I'll choose a winner and then you will get everything within this room for Witcher. Uh, I'll even make an armor stand with all the uh, armor on it as well. So you've got a full set of armor by the time we've finished. So Witchery itself is a very very good mod. Uh, the first thing that you've got to do within Witchery once you decide that you're going to play it uh, is basically uh, you need to run around and go and find something um, pretty simple really. You need to go find some seeds. Uh, so you can get seeds from hitting tall grass. Now um, it doesn't matter which tall grass it is. I mean this is tall grass here but just keep in hitting it you can also kind of cheat a little bit uh, by uh, just bo using bone meal uh, in one specific area uh, that's an easier way to actually do it or you can just run around like a mental person just hitting the ground uh, where there's lots of you know tall grass and stuff uh, the biome that I'm in at the moment is actually quite good for that um, that purpose uh, there's a lot of tall grass around here so we'll just run around and hit it now, what you're actually looking for is, um, it's pretty simple. You're looking for seeds. Now, the seeds that you're looking for, in particular, are these four seeds, I believe. Um, let's see if we've got Ella. Right, you are looking for these ones right here, the mandrake seed from Witchra. You're looking also for the snowbell seeds out of Witchery as well. The water artichoke out of Witchery and the rest of these you're not after so these can go into the bin later. But it's mainly these ones you're looking for and there is one more and hopefully we'll get it soon. The more seeds you get the kind of the better really. Uh, let me just quickly, and I can't do that because I have a rule on my server that you're not allowed to record with chat on, and that is including myself. So let's just quickly do this and give myself fly. Oh shoot, I've gone into the wrong one there. Um, oh, there you go, done. So let's, and I've done it again. There we go, I can fly. Right, so let's go into the right section this time and actually hide the chat so we don't see everybody talking. Uh, there is some people on the server that don't want to be recorded, so respect their wishes. Um, so, yeah, so this is a better biome, actually, because there's lots of grass here. So let's just burn through all this tall grass and hopefully we'll be lucky to collect the last seed, which is right there and that is the one I was actually looking for so let's just see if we can get a couple of these because I mean we're going to need quite a few of the mandrakes alone so 
So yeah, just keep in smashing the grass and get as many of these seeds as you can. Now this is the only way you can get these four seeds, is this is the only method that you can actually get these seeds. You can't get them any other way um, right in the beginning. Uh, later on, when you uh, actually have enough of these seeds, um, kind of like wheat when wheat grows when you smash it you get the wheat seed back plus you get the wheat um, it basically it's the same outcome on these seeds but one of the seeds have a, has a completely different outcome um, you know it's gonna make you work to get the seed back um, and we'll see why very very soon now I think we're about to be done So we'll just keep us rushing these. Right. No, that's more than enough. Right, so what we'll do is we'll just quickly go back over to this area over here. Now, this is more than enough seeds. Um, I will, just one thing I need to clear up just before we actually get back into this one. Uh, the ME system, yes it will be going, and no I will not be using my witchery stuff in the ME system. So any witchery stuff that you see in the ME system, I will not be using it. I'm actually going to be setting up uh, chests over here, uh, and everything we do within this will go into them chests, not into my ME system. Uh, so that's the reason why I've just come over here to get some chests. Um, Let's just get some chests and and that's more than enough chests. And then once you have got your seeds, um, the next step I would take would be to plant them and uh, basically yes you can wait for them to grow but first of all because you need to move on with witchery I would physically uh, I would actually do something different I would uh, go into getting bone meal and then um, actually let's throw all that in some of the ME system and all of these can go into there for now and We'll just run over here and just clear that out. Now, the next thing that you're looking for in witchery, um, let's just grab some dirt from the ME system actually, that would be a good idea. Um, and let me just get some bones. Um, I will just be using main materials. Uh, I won't be using any other witchery stuff like I just said. So that more than enough. And we're just going to set up a little um, a little farm. Um, we're just going to set it up over here. And You only need a little one at the beginning. Uh, you don't need a big, massive one. And um, for the whole of witchery, you don't really need to make huge things. Really, you just, you know, nice and simple. You know, we'll do it every single time for you guys. Um, so the only other thing we need to steal out of my ME system is some water. Uh, do I have any uh, water? Uh, no, I do not. Okay, so let's get some buckets I've got some buckets and I will then just run outside um, and I will get some buckets of water and close that door um, So I just need to clear my inventory so I can just put all these buckets of water down here um, put you there, put you there, that's such sort that one out, you there, you there, you 
through there. And the last one. Just three buckets will do. So you go there, you go there, and you're in the middle. Done. So now what we need to do is just grab a hole. Um, oh, I haven't got any holes. Uh, right, okay, so it's that one. I make this look a little bit neater later on uh, for you guys. So that's going to be our little farm right now. What I would do is I would do this. Uh, the belladonna ones will go at the back. I'd try and get two rows out of it if you can. Uh, now the mandrake ones. These are really, really important, so I would put these ones here. Uh, you will be needing a lot. Uh, these actually produce mandrake, mandrakes and mandrake roots, so you'll be needing those ones as well. And these ones right here, these are just really, really a big pain in the bum um, because sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. But you actually need the ice needles that you receive off these guys uh, so please you know remember and the last seed basically uh, that will just go on to the water itself now what we just need to do is just need to actually make these guys grow up and we can then get into it so that's fully grown that's fully grown that's fully grown that's fully grown that one is that one is and I will show you what the mandrakes do uh, there's the belladonna ones, that's what they look like when they're done. I do this a couple of times uh, when you begin so you can have at least you know a stockpile or a start in a stockpile of these plants uh, because when you get into witchery and start making more of the really really good stuff you know you're gonna be uh, needing basically the things that this you know gives you so just make sure that you've uh, got a backlog of them now all I need to do is grab a sword so let's just grab a diamond sword um, and then we'll just grab some sticks I just need a sword um, you will see why very very soon um, right so basically We'll start at the back. Um, so, Belladonna ones um, give you. You will receive uh, off the Belladonna flowers uh, themselves. You will receive this thing right here, which is a Belladonna flower. You'll also get your seeds back. Now, water artichokes are kind of the same. Uh, they will give you um, a product and they will give you the seed back itself so we got the seeds back uh, this time we actually received more seeds which was good um, and it's the same with the belladonna ones as well we actually received a lot more back so this time I'm actually gonna let them grow cuz uh, let's see um, there you go um, <clears throat> So, um, yeah, the wa uh, water artichokes actually gave you water artichoke globe and the seeds. Now, this uh, snowbell ones, these are the tricky ones because... Right, that gave me a seed and it gave me a snowball uh, right here. That one gave me the same. Oh, that one didn't. That one gave me an ice needle. Uh, the ice needles will be used later on, uh, so just remember you need the ice needles so try and get as many as you can uh, because uh, you will be you know needing the ice needles later on and we'll explain about that now the reason why I've left this one to the end is because I hate it um, unfortunately with like all these ones where I just basically went mental and knocked them all down these ones I do one by one right I was lucky I was lucky again I wonder if that's it. 
if you hit it with a sword it doesn't spawn it didn't spawn okay uh, let's just try that again I'm gonna actually do this because I want you guys to see this um, Why are they not spawning? Okay, it's derping out. Maybe it's server side. It's been nice to me today. Basically, what's meant to happen is it's meant to spawn um, a mandrake. Now, if everybody uh, remembers uh, Harry Potter, um, there is one specific Harry Potter. Now, if you do know the one that it was in, please comment down below um, and tell me. Um, oh, there it is. Bugger, it's not. No, where are you? Ah. Uh, Basically, uh, please comment down below. Tell me which person um, got that nausea and passed out in Harry Potter and which Harry Potter it actually was because I've actually forgot. I do know the person though who uh, passed out in um, in the actual movie itself. Uh, it was one of the pupils that did. So please, you know, comment down below if you know that. Um, so let's just knock this down right so yeah basically that will give you this thing right here which is mandrake root now you need mandrake root uh, you need it as fast as you can because the amount of items that you're going to be doing uh, uh, in which it most of the time it does require you have I wonder if you just hit it with your sword then that if it just gets rid of it because if it does, then that's even better than fighting those little gits. It works that way, doesn't it? It does look that way. Okay, maybe if you know more about witchery than me, you can answer that. That is one thing I can't actually answer. Um, I actually just thought that they came every time you hit it. Maybe it's server side, because we are playing on my server. So maybe it's that. So we got more than enough stuff that um, at the moment so like I said everything I use within this mod uh, within this mod spotlight and um, uh, actual tutorial I will be leaving in the chests for you guys so I do need to take that with me though so I can get in and out of the uh, this little room uh, so the first things that we need for now though is we need this thing and we need this thing right here um, and then we need to go to Witchra. Right now, the first thing that you probably want to make is a thing called Mutandus. Uh, Mutandus is an amazing little thing. It basically, to make it, you need some wood ash, you need eggs, you need uh, bone meal, uh, you need the mandrake root, you need cactus green, and then four wood ash. I'll show you how to make four wood ash in a minute with the item that we're about to make. Right now, to make the first item that you need to make uh, is basically um, this thing right here. You need to make. Why can't I access my ME system? Uh, might have been a bit of server lag. Uh, right, so we go to this thing right here, which is the witch's oven. This is the first thing, the very, very first thing that you need to make within Witcher. Um, I'm just going to make a few of them. Um, because the better because then that means we can just basically you know have a few of them going um, at once later on you can make these a little bit more um, efficient uh, so I'm just gonna actually put them along this wall right here you probably don't need this many but you know um, I've got the materials so why not so I'm gonna put those right there now in that what you need to do then is do this you need to go out and you need to look very very hard for some saplings now the saplings that you are actually looking for are oak ones definitely birch ones 
and then the one that I'm always missing which is uh, spruce so we'll have to just dip outside and go get some spruce ones um, and then basically uh, what you need to do is you need also need to get yourself some clay uh, you need to make sure that you've got uh, clay um, I would suggest that you try and find a Badlands biome or try and find somewhere that has a lot of clay um, because it's one of these things that these soft jars that I'm actually collecting right now uh, you're going to need a lot of them uh, I believe it or not you're going to need tons 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 I've gone through so many uh, so yeah you really do need these guys as much as you can and then basically either coal or charcoal it doesn't really matter something just to burn into that little uh, witch's oven over there let's use some coal because we've got so much of the blooming stuff so let's just uh, that should do and then we'll just go over here and start filling these up now what this is actually going to uh, give you um, is something really really cool uh, the other thing that you need I just remembered uh, we need to just go back over to the AE system and grab some cobble fuck it uh, grab some cobble and just make some normal vanilla furnaces and put them over here and then inside here we need to put those with that and that and that and that and that and then in here we just need to put some coal and in here put some coal and basically just fill all these up you don't need to do all of them i just made a lot of them uh i didn't probably mean to but you know never mind. i've got a lot of resources so it doesn't matter so we'll just uh fill these up with coal um all right so um let's go over here and see how many of these are done uh we've got three in that one three in that one and that gives us seven so you put the jars just here you put your coal just here and then all you need to do is get your sapling and stick it there now this will products this will give you um, wood ash and it will give you an aspect as well or an essence or um, an extract um, it does, it's just loads right so this one for birch gives you the breath of the goddess and it gives you wood ash as well it doesn't do it all the time so uh, you know like that time it didn't give us the bre breath of the goddess just then it actually just gave us another wood ash so you know you just need to leave these you know bubbling along um, to actually do and then you'll be okay so let's just grab some more of this stuff right here and then throw them into there so we can keep in collecting and then we need to start working on um, making uh, let's see that mutandus now the mutandus needs hint of rebirth hint of rebirth is actually from the uh, saplings that I was talking about a moment ago so and we're just gonna nip outside but before I nip outside I'm just going to get myself a uh, let's see let's use a wooden yeah, let's get a wooden one because we only need a wooden one. Uh, I believe the recipe is that. Right, so we just need to go out and get some saplings. Uh, hopefully, we can. Saplings. Uh, so we're looking for spruce that way so what did these give us Some fern that's not spruce that's not spruce 
that is a rubber tree because of this mod pile. There's so many trees. Uh, right, I need spruce, so we're on the hunt, people. Everybody shout out if you see it. I won't hear you, but you can shout out. Um, come on, load all the chunks. Oh, I know where I am. This was my test ground for the uh, for an item. Come on, I'm not gonna find any over here. Uh, don't get them in magic biomes, do you? Do you get them in these biomes? No, it just looks like it's given us rubber ones there. Oh look, a village. That could be handy. Oh wait a minute, I don't even think it's been... I don't think it's been raided. And it hasn't been raided. That's good, that. This is a good find. This is actually a good find. You'll see why this is a good find later on. Um, I'm actually going to leave these guys alone until later. Um, like I said, you'll, you'll find out why later on. It's actually something really, really cool that I need the villagers for within Witcher. So I'm probably going to cut until I can find some proper saplings. Uh, I need spruce saplings. I can't remember which biome they spawn in. But because we've got biomes of plenty. Ooh. Uh, because we've got biomes of plenty on the server as well, it's kind of a, a kind of hustle for which tree and which biome's going to spawn. Um, so I will be right back once I get some spruce saplings. I think worst case scenario, um, I could have took some out of the ME system, but you know I can't because there the oh my god, there is another village. Has this one been raided? Doesn't look like it. Well, that's well cool. Uh, where's the one that I'm looking for? Cool village though. Spawn kinda in a cliff type thing. Cool. So we're just gonna carry on looking for our spruce trees and hopefully I can get some. Come on, there's so many trees. What are they? Are they spruce trees? Or are they coming out as oak trees? Yeah, they're coming out as oak trees. Never mind. So I will be back once I've... Oh, wait a minute. I think I've just found one. I think that is it. Spruce sapling. Alright, so we've got some spruce. This is what we need. Um, for... Oops. I think that is it. There's loads here. Right, so I'll collect these and then I'll meet you back over in that base uh, that we've made for the witchery. Um, and I should be cooking up the spruce saplings when I get back. So I will be right back.